Good morning, folks. Today is Monday, February 26th, 2024, and here's what's coming up this week in TAPS. We just wrapped up a week of solo and small ensemble music performances across the state. Points will be updated today on the TAPS website. We look forward to our medium and large band performances in March and our choir and orchestra performances in April. Follow at TAPS Music on Twitter for more. This week, we are headed to Waco for the 2024 TAPS Basketball State Final Four tournaments. We have 36 games lined up between Wednesday and Saturday across all six classifications in boys and girls basketball. And here's how it looks. In 1A girls basketball, up first, it's Texoma Christian School of Sherman versus Prestonwood Christian Academy North of Prosper. Texoma earned their spot in the Final Four with a 46-10 win over Victory Baptist Academy of Weatherford. In the regional playoffs, while PCA punched their ticket to the state semifinals with a 42-39 victory over Christian Heritage Classical out of Longview. On the other side of the bracket, we have Harvest Christian Academy of Edinburgh versus Heritage School of Fredericksburg. Harvest Christian advances to the semifinal after defeating Covenant Academy of Cyprus 84-32 in the regional round, while Heritage earned their spot defeating Livingstone's Christian School of Alvin 52-27. Catch Texoma Christian versus PCA on Wednesday, 10 a.m. at Robertson High School in Robertson. Harvest Christian will face Heritage School Wednesday at noon, also at Robertson High School. The 1A Girls Championship will be decided Thursday, February 29th at 10 a.m. at Robinson High School. Your 1A Boys Basketball Final Four. Game 1, it's Prestonwood Christian Academy North out of Prosper versus Kingdom Collegiate Academy of DeSoto. PCA earned their spot in the Final Four, defeating Texoma Christian School of Sherman 72-49 in the regional round and Kingdom Collegiate punched their ticket to Waco with a 72-49 victory over Christian Heritage Classical out of Longview. On the other side of the bracket, it's going to be Cornerstone Christian of San Angelo versus Founders Christian School of Spring. Cornerstone defeated First Baptist Academy of Universal City 49-36 in the regional round, while Founders Christian defeated Brazosport Christian School of Lake Jackson 69-56. Catch the PCA versus Kingdom Collegiate prep game on Wednesday at 6 p.m. Cornerstone Christian will face Founders Christian Wednesday at 8. Both semifinal games will be held at University High School in Waco. The 1A Boys Championship will be held Thursday, 8 p.m. at Robinson High School. In 2A Girls Basketball, up first it's Southcrest Christian School of Lubbock versus Ovilla Christian School. Catch that game at 2 p.m. Wednesday at Robinson High School. Southcrest advances to the semifinals after a 52-42 victory over Sacred Heart of Munster. Ovilla Christian School moved up to the penultimate game after defeating Kingdom Preparatory Academy of Lubbock 57-38 in the regional championship. On the other side of the bracket, it's First Baptist Academy of Dallas versus Covenant Christian School of Conroe. Catch that at Robinson High School this Wednesday at 4 p.m. First Baptist advances to the semifinals after defeating St. Joseph Catholic School of Bryan by one point in the regional round. Final score there was 37-36. to Covenant Christian earned their spot in the Final Four by defeating Sacred Heart Catholic School of Hallettsville 40-15. to The 2A Girls Championship will be decided Thursday, February 29th at 12 p.m. on the court at Robinson High School. In the 2A Boys Final Four, up first it's two Fort Worth schools, Christian Life Preparatory versus Bethesda Christian School. Catch that game at University High School Wednesday at 10 a.m. Christian Life advances to the semifinals after a 50-41 win over Ascension Academy of Amarillo in the regional round. Bethesda advances to the Final Four with a 65-49 victory over Abilene Christian School. Deciding the other side of the bracket, Wednesday 12 p.m. on the court at University High School, it's First Baptist Academy of Dallas versus O'Connell College prep out of Galveston. First Baptist earned their spot with a 56-30 win over Bracken Christian School of Bolverde in the regional round, while O'Connell College Prep made it with a 65-60 victory over Sacred Heart Catholic School of Hallettsville. The 2A Boys Championship will be settled at Robinson High School on Thursday, February 29th, beginning at 4 p.m. Moving up to 3A Girls Basketball, we've got Lubbock Christian School versus San Jacinto Christian Academy of Amarillo on one side of the bracket, with Brazosport Christian School of Bryan versus Rosehill Christian School 
school of Tomball on the other. Lubbock Christian advances to the Final Four with a 67-33 win over Cornerstone Christian Academy of McKinney, while San Jacinto Christian earned their spot with a 47-19 win over Covenant Classical of Fort Worth. Brazos Christian makes it to the Final Four with a 62-28 win over the Christian School at Castle Hills of San Antonio. Rose Hill Christian advances with a 68-33 win over Live Oak Classical of Waco in the regional round. Watch Lubbock Christian take on San Jacinto Wednesday, 6 p.m. at Robinson High School. Brazos Christian will face Rose Hill at 8 p.m. also at Robinson High School. The 3A girls' state title will be decided Thursday, February 29th at 2 p.m. on the court at Robinson High School. Over in 3A Boys Basketball, we've got Lubbock Christian School versus Bishop Gorman Catholic School out of Tyler. And on the other side of the bracket, it's Westbury Christian School of Houston versus St. Francis Episcopal School, also of Houston. Games will take place at University High School on Wednesday at 2 p.m. and 4 p.m. respectively. LCS earned their spot defeating Akibayavna Academy of Dallas 60-32 in the regional round, while Bishop Gorman advances through Lucas Christian Academy with a 43-36 win. West Westbury advances after beating New Braunfels Christian Academy 72-59, while St. Francis Episcopal School punched their ticket to the state Final Four, defeating Live Oak Classical 90-55 in the regional round. The 3A Boys Championship will be decided on the court at Robinson High School on Thursday at 6 p.m. Up in 4A Girls Basketball, it's Grace Prep Academy of Arlington versus Lake Country Christian School of Fort Worth. Fighting for the other championship spot will be Geneva School of Bernie and Bay Area Christian Academy of League City. Grace Prep advances to the semifinals after a 54-45 win over Brook Hill School of Bullard in the regional round. Lake Country advances after a 52-37 win over Trinity Christian Academy of Willow Park. Catch Grace Prep and Lake Country Thursday, February 29th at University High School starting at 2 p.m., followed by the Geneva versus Bay Area Christian game at 4 p.m., also at University High School. The 4A Girls Championship game is scheduled to begin Friday, March 1st at 1.30 p.m. on the court at Robinson High School. In 4A Boys Championship, basketball. Up first on Friday, March 1st at 10 a.m., it's Trinity Christian School of Lubbock versus Grace Prep Academy of Arlington, followed by Brentwood Christian School of Austin versus St. Thomas's Episcopal School of Houston. That's at 12 p.m. Both games are at University High School. Trinity Christian earned their spot in the Final Four, defeating McKinney Christian Academy 65-54 in the regional round, while Grace Prep earned their spot with a 77-61 win over Prince of Peace Christian School of Carrollton. Brentwood Christian advanced advances after their 77-64 win over Legacy Preparatory Christian Academy of the Woodlands. St. Thomas's Episcopal advances after their 76-56 win over the Geneva School of Bernie. The 4A Boys Championship will be decided Saturday, March 2nd at 11 a.m. on the court at Robinson High School. Moving up to the 5A girls bracket. In the North semifinal, we have Liberty Christian School of Argyle versus Southwest Christian School of Fort Worth. And in the South semifinal, we have St. Mary's Hall of San Antonio versus Second Baptist School of Houston. Those games will take place at University High School on Thursday at 10 a.m. and 12 p.m. respectively. Liberty Christian earned their Final Four spot after defeating Grapevine Faith Christian School in the regional round 33-25, while Southwest Christian School advances after defeating All Saints Episcopal of Fort Worth 47-38. St. Mary's Hall earned a trip to Waco with a 44-35 victory over San Antonio Christian School, while Second Baptist School earned their playoff spot with a 68-47 win over St. Joseph Academy of Brownsville. The 5A Girls Championship will take place on Friday, March 1st at 11 a.m. at Robinson High School. In 5A Boys Championship Basketball, fighting for a shot at the state championship, we have Midland Christian High School versus St. Michael's Catholic Academy of Austin and the Woodlands Christian Academy versus Second Baptist School of Houston. Catch those games Friday, March 1st at University High School beginning at 2 p.m. and 4 p.m. respectively. Midland Christian earned their ticket to Waco with a 46-38 win over Regent School of Austin in the regional championships. St. Michael's advances after a 79-56 victory over Southwest Christian School of Fort Worth. The Woodlands earned their Final Four spot with a 77-57 win over San Antonio Christian School, while Second Baptist advances to the Final Four with a 59-49 win over San Antonio's TMI Episcopal School. The 5A Boys Championship will take place on Saturday, March 2nd at 1.30 p.m. on the court at Robinson High School. 
School. In 6A Girls Basketball, Ursuline Academy of Dallas will face the Village School of Houston for a shot at the state title, while Bishop Lynch High School of Dallas will face Antonian College Prep of San Antonio on the other side of the bracket. Both games will take place at University High School on Thursday, February 29th at 6 p.m. and 8 p.m. respectively. Ursuline earned their Final Four spot with a 60-48 win over Parish Episcopal School of Dallas in the regional championships, while the Village School earned a trip to Waco with a 59-52 victory over Prestonwood Christian Academy of Plano. Bishop Lynch advances after a 53-33 win over Concordia Lutheran of Tomball, and Antonian advances with a 58-52 win over John Paul II High School of Plano. The 6A Girls Championship will be decided on Friday, March 1st at 4 p.m. on the court at Robinson High School. And finally, in the 6A Boys Championship Final Four, up first we have Parish Episcopal School of Dallas versus Prestonwood Christian Academy of Plano. On the other side of the bracket, we have John Paul II High School of Plano versus Antonian College Preparatory High School of San Antonio. Both games will take place on Friday, March 1st at University High School in Waco at 6 p.m. and 8 p.m. respectively. Parrish advances to the semifinals after defeating Bishop Lynch 54-49 in the regional round. Prestonwood advances after a one-point win over St. Thomas High School of Houston 57-56. JP2 moved up after a 71-59 victory over Nolan Catholic High School of Fort Worth, while Antonian earned their spot in the Final Four with a 70-61 win over Trinity Christian Academy of Addison. The 6A Boys Championship will be decided at Robinson High School on Saturday, March 2nd at 4 p.m. Be sure to follow at Taps Basketball on Twitter for results and updates. Get your tickets at taps.biz slash tickets or on the Hometown Ticketing app. You can watch all games on Taps TV, which you can get to from the Taps TV app on your phone, tablet, or smart TV, or watch at tapstvnetwork.com on your browser. You can listen to Taps Radio broadcasts for free at, at taps.biz slash radio. I'll have links to all of this in the show notes. Next week, join us at the Round Rock Multipurpose Complex in Round Rock for our 2024 Winter Soccer Final Four. More details and brackets as they are updated at taps.biz. Be sure to follow at Taps Soccer on Twitter for more as we get closer to those championships. A few more items to mention before we close this week. We've been finishing up photos from previous TAPS events. All dance photos are available as of last week. We have also uploaded photos from all three Swimming State Championships from last week. We have more to come from our second photographer who was on site. Wrestling photos. We'll have to wait until after basketball and soccer, but those are in the works. I'll try to get some uploaded before we leave, but no promises. You can find all TAPS event photos at taps.smugmug.com. Remember, all all downloads are free and you can order prints if you like. Do you have any news from your school that you'd like included in a future episode? We are always looking for things to include in our podcasts. Just send an email to talk at taps.biz. That's it for This Week in Taps. This Week in Taps is a production of the Texas Association of Private and Parochial Schools. It is produced and hosted by me, John Skees, the Director of Media for Taps. Brian Bunselmeyer is our Executive Director. Robert Huckabee is our Associate Director and Director of Compliance. Steve Prudhomme is our Associate Director. Steve Fuhulin is our Athletic Director. Rhonda Smith is our Director of Fine Arts. Liz Cornett is our General Manager of Corporate Partnerships. Kelly Bay, Delaney Bunselmeyer, Will Dixon, and Vicki Morgan help keep everything running smoothly in the Taps office from transfer paperwork to event logistics to live broadcasts. Thank you for listening. See you next week.